As more and more businesses begin to open their doors across the UK, shopkeepers are increasingly looking for ways to ensure the chances of COVID-19 spreading are kept to a minimum. One measure being widely employed is banning the use of cash, instead asking customers to reach for their debit or credit card. Like many businesses across London, Café Donata has ditched handling money for the foreseeable future. We, we know it's very important for customers and staff to feel safe. So one of the first things that we did is to say we're going to go cashless. It all has to be paid by card. And because our value of our product, its transaction value is normally between 5 to £10 pounds on average, cash contains so many germs. When you're touching cash, um, it's a known fact that, that notes and coins and they carry a lot of germs. So um, it makes it a lot easier. It reduces the contact between staff and customers. But while cashless shops are becoming more of a common sight across the high street, just how popular is paying with plastic among customers? I think it's a little bit of uh, overreaction, as they say in America, but, uh, well, they're trying to protect themselves, like, you know what I mean? Um, so that, if they think that's the way to do it, then so be it, you know? I prefer to pay by card, and uh, it hasn't changed my uh, uh, practice. I think it will be a permanent policy now for the businesses. And I think it's a good thing. It shouldn't be that discrimination. If someone needs to pay by cash, they should be able to pay by cash. Um, let's, for argument's sake, if they've maybe got autistic, they've got a pattern. Cash is part of that pattern. So yeah, you, you've got to give that option for both. With more retail stores expected to open across England on June 15th, the use of card will likely remain key in helping to reduce the risk of infection inside shops and stores. Trent Murray, Euronews.